all right so in today's video we'll be looking at color grading or editing this particular image under five minutes i'm trying to challenge myself i also throw this challenge to you guys i'll leave a link down in the description to this particular raw file challenge yourself five minutes let's see what you can do because i've been asked a lot of times how long does it take me to color grade um i usually tell them under five minutes well i'm lying i have not told anyone under five and i'm like i'm always like i'm probably 10 minutes 15 minutes tops but i'm trying to challenge myself and i'll also challenge you guys since i'll be providing a raw file i did provide another raw file in my previous video from this particular shoot session if you haven't watched that video watch how i achieved all these amazing images right from the said video but we'll be working on this particular image trying to edit this make sure it's in the direction we want just under five minutes so without much ado don't forget to subscribe turn on the bell notification icon and also don't forget to share this video let's put five minutes on the clock now let's go right so first thing i'll do is to just reduce the exposure it looks too bright for me in it then i'll just open up my whites a little bit reduce the highlight just because i need the information here right open up my shadows and clip my blacks a little bit right so looking at this i'll come back here and i don't like the lights fall off at the edges so i'm just going to open it up a little bit i would rather put in the vignette pushing some um, contrast then i'll come into my curve adjustment come into my luma and create a reverse s curve right that softens up my image for me a little bit then i will come back to my exposure and increase my contrast because i just removed contrast all right come back to my detail remove sharpness and yeah i'm done i really don't like keeping some sharpness in my image so right from here i'll just jump into the color tab and the first thing i'll need to do is to make sure my base characteristics i think i'm just going to leave it at um uh, mac Ford generic right i hope i'm under five minutes so i'm just going to you know make this image look perfect now let's reduce the brightness i need the brightness down i just i just i need that contrasty punchiness in this image so open up the shadows a little bit just to bring back the details in here right then color editor what am i going to do in the color editor i feel like the skin right let's see the in the yellows reds yep right so move it towards the reds also i'll do the same thing to the yellows because of the color i'm seeing over here right i'll reduce the saturation a little bit and reduce the luminance i'll do the same thing to the red also well, i don't think doing that to the red will help let's see that's of the yellows all right what next i can do is to play along with this this will actually do the trick for me so oh too much too much the engine is too strong i don't think i'll use this side i'll use the skin tone instead the skin tone will help let me change let me change the hue unify the hue a little bit reduce the lightness reduce the saturation or no, let's increase the saturation all right i'll come here reduce the saturation then back to this what i will do here is to add some blues into my shadows but not too much the shadows look and we use this push some teal into my metals and then some warmth into the highlight so this is where we started from and this is where we are at before and after before and after so what i would want to do next is to tackle this let's see the white outfit i need it to be as white as possible so reduce the saturation and open the lightness let's keep tackling it right now i have it's looking this way i feel like i can do more with my 
think that should be it i should use the exposure more and there i have this looking like this so this is the before and that is the after before and after there's quite an amount of information in the shadows i can work with everything is toned down well exposed then yeah that should be it let me see bring yeah open up the exposure here a little bit and no the fade doesn't work for me okay okay what else what else can we do what else can we do let's change the hue of the uh, the greens right make it more prominent that's i am let's see blues magenta and purple all right and let's crop this to size four by five and then we are done right so this brings me to the end of today's video i hope i did this under five minutes let's see if i did well i was a little bit over time but i think you get you get the challenge right so if you enjoyed this video and if you want to see more of these challenges can you let me know down in the comment section below and i apologize for not producing a video last week i was going through some renovation processes i think i'm done now and i'll continue my light and color videos so before i give you any other video just enjoy this particular challenge i did here i know i can do more given more time which of course like i said i edit under 10 15 minutes when it comes to you know basic adjustments and color grading in capture one right so i could have done more but for the five minute challenge we did this is what i could come up with let me see what you can do if you will be honest to yourself let me see what you can do under five minutes with this said image like i said i'll leave a link down in the description box below don't forget to check it out download it play around with it i would prefer you not post it just post it on your story and tag me i'll leave my handle down in the description box also and yeah let's just enjoy this particular challenge thank you so much for watching today's video don't forget to subscribe don't forget to turn on the bell notification icon to get notified when you know such videos like these come up let me know like i said down in the comment section if you enjoyed this challenge and if you want to see more of these challenges and i'll see you in my next video peace